Okay, so in a show of hands, who in here works out? Okay, cool, some more than um, Who in here works out at least five times a week for at least 30 minutes? Okay. Well, obviously, we all know exercise is important, and it leads us to a very long and happy, healthy lifestyle. But today, I'm going to be persuading you all to get up and get active for at least five times a week for 30 minutes. Overall, it benefits four things. Energy, mental health, sleep, and our physique. So with that being said, number one, energy. You might not feel energetic right after the gym. I know I don't. It gradually takes time. But according to everydayhealth.com, any exercise or physical activity that gets the heart rate up and the blood flowing, releases endorphins, is going to really boost your energy levels. From my experience, after working out, I might not feel energetic, but you know, like I said, gradually it takes time. MayoClinic.org states, exercise and physical activity deliver oxygen and nutrients to your tissues and help your cardiovascular system work more and efficiently. When your heart and lungs work more and efficiently, you have more energy to go about your daily duties a lot easier. So therefore, energy is very important and necessary. With that being said, number two, your physique. Obviously, a major plus is how good we can look, but what I think is more important is how good and how good you can feel and how healthy you are. Exercise controls your body weight and shapes your muscle tone and definition. After working out for a couple months, you'll notice a change in your body, not only in how you feel, but in how you look as well. According, according to sciencedaily.com, they state, being physically active lowers the risk of heart disease. So not only does it benefit your physique, but most importantly, your overall health. In my opinion, I love being able to say I feel good and alive rather than I could fit into my size two pair of jeans. That's all due to exercise. Now number three, sleep. According to an article I found on nytimes.com, exercise helps sleep and stimulate longer periods of slow wave sleep which is the best kind of sleep you can get in my opinion. I don't know about you guys, but I love getting a, a good night's rest. I can honestly say I've been working out since I was 13 and I have slept better since. According to greatest.com, in one recent study, scientists looked at the effects of exercise on sedentary women and men in their 40s who had been diagnosed with insomnia. Those who participated in a 16-week exercise intervention slept longer and woke up less often than those who remained inactive. Other research has more optimistic results, but some studies suggest that when insomnia patients add exercise to their daily routines, they experience less anxiety and get more sleep at night. With that being said, it can take some time to adjust to a new exercise routine and see any big changes in sleep patterns, but there's still enough evidence to say it's worth committing to a more active lifestyle. Number four, which I think is the most important, mental health. We all know what it's like to be sad, frustrated, heartbroken, maybe even a little depressed, but exercise is key and is known to relieve stress. According to Huffington Post, one of the most common mental beliefs of exercise is stress relief. Working up a sweat can help manage both physical and mental stress. What happens is exercise increases concentrations of morphine, a chemical that moderates the brain's response to stress. Exercise can even alleviate symptoms among the clinically depressed. Exercise releases endorphins, which creates feelings of happiness. I don't know about you all, but I like feeling happy most of my days. Um, I don't, a lot of people think that you will feel no change in your endorphins if you only work out for 30 minutes. That's not true. Working out for 30 minutes a few times a week can instantly boost your overall mood. Personally, I know that when I'm having a bad day, going for a going for a jog or getting a little dance session in really helps me a lot. With that being said, I'm going to show you a video that hopefully motivates you all to start living a better and active lifestyle.
harder than everyone else. While you were sleeping, I've already done 150 suicides around three miles. My game might not be perfect. It's a work in progress. For every shot I make out here, it's another reason to fear me on the court. What you don't see is the hours of dedication I put in every single day of my life. What makes me is not what happens in a game, rather when no one is around. This is not a choice. It's the way of life. So just remember, when you're sleeping, I'm out here working every day to be one step ahead of everyone else. So, I personally love that video because whenever I'm feeling lazy, it just like gets me going and motivates me to get to the gym. I know he's talking about like his basketball career and stuff like that, but it just motivates me and inspires me to keep going. Now, there is a type of exercise out there for everyone. Personally, my favorite is Zumba, running, and hiking. So just find something that interests you and it'll keep you going. If you're looking to live a long and healthy lifestyle, it all begins with exercise and movement. Remember that, and remember it benefits sleep, energy, your mental health, and your physique. I'm going to leave you all with one of my favorite quotes by Plato. Lack of activity destroys the good condition of every human being, while movement and physical exercise save it and preserve it.